Good morning and welcome to Falcon TV News Today. It is Tuesday, April 27th, 2021. I'm Ken along the rest of the FTV crew. The U.S. passed more than 200 million vaccine doses this week, meeting President Joe Biden's pledge to reach the goal within his first 100 days in office. That means that more than 52% of U.S. adults have been vaccinated, along with 80% of seniors. With the country averaging 3 million shots administered per day, Despite the progress, however, experts worry the U.S. may be close to the tipping point where vaccine supply outpaces demand. Recent surveys suggest 62% of Americans have either gotten or plan to get vaccinated, with another 70% planning to wait and see. At the current pace of vaccinations, the primary demand of vaccines may be satisfied by, by mid to late May. By early this summer, nearly every U.S. adult who wants to get vaccinated will have had the opportunity, but most children will not, ha will not have gotten a shot. For now, no children under 16 are eligible. The combination will create complex decisions for many families about whether to send children to daycare to get together with friends and relatives, eat in restaurants, or travel on airplanes. Pfizer said earlier this month that its COVID vaccine was more than 91% effective at protecting against the virus and more than 90% effective against severe disease up to six months after the second dose. Moderna's vaccine, which uses technology similar to Pfizer's, was also shown to remain highly effective at six months. Researchers say they still don't know how long protection against the virus lasts after six months of being fully vaccinated. Though public health officials and health experts expect protection to wane after some time. Should Americans require booster shots, the U.S. government would likely need to make arrangements with the drug makers to supply additional doses and make plans for vaccine distribution. Most Americans have been looking forward to the moment of herd immunity when enough people are protected through vaccinations or past infections to stop the spread of COVID-19. Once there, public officials have said masks won't be necessary and hugging and handshakes, not to mention gyms, bars, and indoor dining can return. But even as more than half a dose of adult Americans have received at least one dose of vaccine and others Many and many others are protected by recent infections. Health experts are moving away from the idea of reaching some magic number. Dr. Anthony Fauci doesn't want to talk about herd immunity anymore. He said rather than concentrating on an elusive number, let's get as many people vaccinated as quickly as as quickly as we possibly can. What Dr. Fauci doesn't explicitly state, but what but others do is that with about a quarter of Americans saying they might not want to be immunized. Herd immunity is simply not an attainable goal. It's theoretically pos possible, but we as a society have rejected that, said the doctor and director of the Mayo Clinic Vaccine Research Group, adding there is no errat eradication at this point. It's off the table. The only thing we can talk about is control. Congratulations to the prom court for 2020 and 21. There are Cassandra Booth, Nadia Bouyalkins, Sadie Crispo, Michaela Green, Jasmine LeClaire, Alexi Pumatep, Asimbo Algo, Andre Boyer, Dickie Chen, Sal Charmonte, Ryan Liberty, and Michael Green O'Brien. Again, tickets are now on sale to all seniors. Today, we look at another teen center's health tips and activities as part of their De Stress for Success campaign. Here is now is video two of the series. Hello, Falcon family. I want to introduce you to the singing bowl. The singing bowl allows vibrations to settle within you. So as I tap the bowl, I just want you to close your eyes, look at this video, find something on the wall to focus on, but just let your mind be. Have this moment to yourself and let your mind just enjoy the singing bowl. Vibration to settle you. If you're getting 
ready for a test, allow the bowl to settle you. If you're having a problem with a friend or a partner, allow the bowl to settle you. Allow the bowl's vibration to settle inside of you and find your peace. Tomorrow, Spirit Day, don't forget to wear your wacky clothing, socks, headbands, crazy colors, and more. That is all I have for today. So for me and everyone here at Valkyrie TV, have a great day.